Hi, East Midlands Councils are funded by the Department of Leveling Up Housing and Communities to provide a welcome programme for those arriving on the Hong Kong British National Overseas Route. I'd like to give you an insight into the partnership work we're involved in to improve access to employment and to harness the talent of these new arrivals to the UK. Through our East Midlands Chamber contacts, we're privileged to work with some amazing local businesses who've come forward to support the BNO community, and I hope you're inspired by what you see on this short film. My last name is So, that's where the So Good of So comes from, from the So Good. And um, good stands for four things, actually. So the first has got to taste good. Second, it's got to be good for your health. Third, it's good for the planet. And fourth, and most importantly, it's got to be good for the society. So I've always believed that a good business can change lives. And the whole social mission around So Good Kombucha is to be able to hire, train um, refugees and others who are marginalized in society and who would otherwise find it difficult to find um, employment opportunities. So I've actually been a supporter of Upbeat Communities for a long time and um, the last year or so I joined recently on the board as trustee and it's such a privilege to be able to work with um, a wonderful organization that are really caring for those who are um, often ignored in, in the bottom of society. So I was born in Hong Kong and uh, and obviously there's um, through different ways I was able to get in touch with a lot of Hong Kongers who've uh, come to the UK over the last couple of years over political issues and um, I found that you know they've got huge talents, um, really well educated, trained, uh, they're very resourceful, really efficient, um, they work really really hard and most of all they really want to contribute and to give back to a place where they have now made their home. Um, and I find that these wonderful um, you know, accountants and IT managers are only being able to find work in warehouses and places that are not really utilizing their, their skills and their talents. Uh, so it's just, um, I thought I'll do whatever I can to help um, get them back onto their, their chosen career path. The Pathway to Employment project really came from a heart to be able to help Hong Kongers from the very early stages uh, of job seeking process. So we started out with the CV clinic and Hong Kongers tend to undersell themselves. So instead of being able to articulate what they bring to an organization, what they've done, they just list out tasks. So we wanted to start out with that. So that was a CV clinic. And then the next project is to be able to help you know, improve their LinkedIn profiles and um, offer them interview tips and give them a chance to actually meet employers uh, and to highlight some of the cultural differences that, that are um, between Hong Kong and the UK and how they may overcome that in, um, through the interview process. Hoob is a performance sportswear brand that was born in the garage and a desire to create product that was research proven with science and maybe took away some of the myths from some of the other brands certainly I'd work for. We're very dominant in the world of triathlon, swimming wetsuits, and we've moved into the category of cycling where things are going wonderfully, and open water swimming, which of course had a massive boom over lockdown. Um, Angie, who's come over on, on the visa, is working out phenomenally. We're so lucky to have Angie. She's such a committed, tenacious, process-driven, wanting to please worker. We could not be happier. And the whole process has been so easy. You know, any business would expect uh, to, to bring an employee in on that route, it to be, you know, laden with intense paperwork and such a long process. But it's been so quick and so easy. And Angie has done most of the work on this. We've had to do very, very little. And I'm absolutely gobsmacked how easy it's been to get a fantastic worker into our, our business. So we, we see workers with all different abilities and approaches and attitudes towards work but what we've, we've found with Angie who's coming on the program that you have someone who really wants to work, really wants to make a difference and isn't clock watching and isn't worried about the external pieces. It's just, how can I come to work and get an incredible job done, communicate very, very well, and just make sure that the goal is here. And, and typically it's early because there's a genuine, genuine desire just to overachieve every single time. 
this is just a couple of examples of the positive work we're doing in employment. We're also working with NHS careers and local language providers to improve access. I hope you've been inspired by this film and if you want any more information please feel free to get in touch with me.